Hello everyone, welcome to NOLO tutorial. Today we're showing you how to set up NOLO CV1 with Sony PSVR for Steam VR gameplay on PC. So stay tuned. Please have the devices and play area ready. We need NOLO CV1, Sony PSVR, and a VR ready computer. Here's the recommended play area setup. As you can see, we'll install the necessary software on PC, Steam, Steam VR, and desired VR game. The install supporting software on PC, then install the supporting software on your PC, Nolo Assistant, and Trinus PSVR. Next we set up Trinus PSVR. Launch Trinus PSVR. Select the main tab, tick Nolo VR. Select the Help tab, click the Install option, then find Steam VR Driver. Click Install to install Steam VR Driver. Then we start the hardware setup. Connect Sony PSVR to PC. We connect Cable 1 to HDMI port on PC, Cable 2 to USB port on PC, Cable 3 to Power Supply, Cable 5 to PSVR headset, respectively. Next, we attach the mount in the middle on the top of the headset. Insert the headset marker to the mount. Then connect the headset marker to PC using the 4 meter cable that was included with NOLO. Place the base station on the outer edge of a flat and stable surface. Optimized height is at shoulder level. Press the power button to turn it on. Press the system button on the controller to turn it on. The LED should be solid green once turned on successfully. Now we go back to our PC to set up the Nolo Assistant and Trinus PSVR. Launch Nolo Assistant. Select the Sony PSVR and Trinus PSVR mode. Click Start Game. It will automatically launch Trinus PSVR. In Trinus PSVR, select the Main tab, then click Start. Next, we launch Steam and Steam VR. If the tracking is wrong in Steam VR Home, please go through the high calibration. Place the headset on the floor facing the base station. The distance should be at least 2 meters. Make sure that there is no block between the headset marker and base station. Press the pair button on the headset marker to complete the height calibration. If the orientation is wrong on SteamVR Home, please go through the orientation calibration. Put on the headset, take two controllers in hand, and swirl the wrist a little bit. With the headset facing the base station and the controllers pointing at the base station, double click the system button on the left controller, then the right controller respectively, to finish the calibration of controller orientation. Now start a VR game and dive into an awesome virtual world. <laughs> 